And my stomach feels like it's about to explode. Oh, I got a burp. Oh. oh, I need a burp. Oh, I can't burp. And welcome back to the beer garden on another winter and holiday edition. That's why all the trees are dead. It's here, here in the middle of the winter time, regardless of the time of the year you're watching this video. Glad to have you along. And hey, if you're here because you like beer, and let's be honest, why else would you be here? Uh, please tap that subscribe button down below. We are going all the way to 2K. 2,000 subscribers, that's our goal. We'd like to have you along for the ride. And uh, up this round, another fan request, a big time fan favorite for Sierra Nevada Celebration Fresh Hop IPA. And if you are, so, are a subscriber to this channel, you know that IPAs and I don't get along. I'm just not a sophisticated enough beer drinker to enjoy an IPA. And so that must be why it is a viewer request because uh, a lot of you like to see me suffer. But uh, this is Sierra Nevada. I'm a big fan of their beers. I like just about everything they cook up. Uh, their Celebration Fresh Hop IPA. Uh, I think I had it last year. Uh, I'm not exactly certain. I gotta be honest, I didn't do any research at all on this beer. I, I do like that it says it's family owned, operated, and argued over. It's from California, hence Sierra Nevada, from Chico, California, but they also brew it in Mills River, North Carolina. And to me, I'm all about brews coming from the source, and I like it to come from one source because the water makes a big difference in the taste of the beer. And so the Chico, California version of this uh, will taste different than the uh, Mills River, North Carolina version of this. I'm assuming this would be the North Carolina version because it's closer to where I live now. And it is a brisk, breezy day here in the beer garden. Some of the leaves are falling, and I've got my, my beer deckle uh, over top the glass to keep all the uh, all the leaves out. Coming up at the end of this brew review, I'm going to be rating Sierra Nevada Celebration Fresh Hop IPA out of five stars. Five being a very good winter and holiday brew. Uh, not part of the cheap category, no. Uh, but this was doable. I think it was $8.99 a six pack. And for, you know, uh, a very limited series edition seasonal beer uh, with the quality that Sierra Nevada produces, eh, I'm all right. I'm all right with that. So it's time to pop the top and see what we got. Can you hear me? Let me fix my microphone. I don't think it's... Can you hear me better now? Can you hear me? We'll edit all this out. Time to pop the top and see what we got. Eh, very laid back California open. Maybe it is from California. Time for the pour into the sold out Beer Snobs Cheap Brew Review pint glass. Only to be accompanied by the sold out Beer Snobs Cheap Brew Review Leather Patch Trucker Cap. Very nice, very hipster. Of course, if you're drinking a beer from California, you gotta be hip. I anticipated this being a lot darker, uh, but that's all right. It being a celebration, you know, a lot, of, a lot of these celebration, you know, winter and holiday brews are so darn dark. And I do like a dark beer, but they really overdo it, sort of, uh, with the spices and things like that. But that's a very nice color, look at there. Uh, it's an amber in color. The head's a little soapier than I would care. Well, no, okay, right in the middle, it's, it's a little fluffy. I'm getting a sweet nose, a very floral aroma, 6.8% alcohol. It's time for the liquid to hit the lips. And hey, I don't want to drink alone. Grab yourself a beer. All right, let's winter and holiday. It's a really cold beer. I get a bit of a brain freeze, and my stomach feels like it's about to explode. Oh, I got a burp. Oh, oh I got a burp. Oh, I can't burp. Oh, something's happening. Okay. While I'm waiting for the burp, uh, that is very hoppy. Very hoppy. Hence the Fresh Hop IPA. Uh, very, very hoppy. Very, very floral. Oh, I, I really got a burp bad. Got a huge gas bubble sitting right in there. N not heavy, yet hoppy. Uh, 
think I lost consciousness there for just a second. But is overall a nice. I mean, you could even drink this, uh, say, in the springtime. I would say this would even be a good summertime beer. It's not available in the summertime, but uh, I think it would be. It's it's that palatable and drinkable, uh, for lack of a uh, more sophisticated term. So out of five stars, five being a very good winter and holiday brew. Where do I rank Sierra Nevada Celebration Hop IPA? Again, I'm not a fan of the IPAs, but I want to be relatively objective and fair. It is good quality. Look at the lacing there. Uh, you taste quality. Nothing tastes cheap in this at all. Uh, it's not really my thing, but out of five stars, I'm going to give you, I'm going to go ahead and rack you up at a, a solid four, 4.0 out of five stars. Hey, if you made it this far in the brew review, please tap that subscribe button. Uh, love to have you along for the ride with our subscribers all the way to 2K. 2,000 subscribers is our next goal, and we appreciate your help and support. Love to hear your comments down below, or read your comments down below, and also suggestions of other brews uh, you would like to see me review. Always love to hear it. And join our group on Facebook, A Beer Snob's Cheap Brew Review. Even the haters, because the haters are fun to screw with. And hey, it's the holiday season here in the beer garden. Hope you have a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year, regardless of the time of year you're watching this video. It's a beautiful day, so grab yourself a beer and you drink that beer. Happy winter and holiday. Cheers.